Welcome to our podcast, where we cover unique and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss a 3 19 million year old brain found in a fish fossil. The oldest example of a well preserved vertebrate brain has been discovered following the scan of the skull of a 319 million year old fossilized fish, a CNN report says. The latest find throws new light on the early evolution of bony fish. Researchers of the study published in the journal Nature on Wednesday said that the fossil of the skull belongs to the extinct Conocephalus wild and was found in a coal mine in England over a hundred years ago. Scientists from the University of Michigan in the US and the University of Birmingham in the UK used the non-destructive imaging technique of computed tomography scanning to look inside the skull and examine its internal bodily structure since the fossil is the only known specimen of the fish species. The sea wildy was an early ray-finned fish. It had a backbone and fins supported by bony rods called rays. It used to eat small aquatic animals and insects, the researchers said. The brains of ray-finned fish display structural features that are not seen in other vertebrates. There is a forebrain consisting of neural tissue that folds outward, according to the study. This tissue folds inward in other vertebrates. The CT image showed an unidentified blob, a University of Michigan press release said. A clearly defined structure with features found in vertebrate skulls were clearly visible. It was bilaterally symmetrical and contained hollow spaces similar in appearance to ventricles. It also had extending filaments resembling cranial nerves. This is such an exciting and unanticipated find, study co-author Sam Giles told CNN. Giles added that they had no idea there was a brain inside the skull when they thought about studying the skull. It was so unexpected that it took us a while to be certain that it actually was a brain. Aside from being just a preservational curiosity, the anatomy of the brain in this fossil has big implications for our understanding of brain evolution in fishes, she added. Researchers say that unlike hard bones and teeth, brain tissue, which is soft and preserved in vertebrate fossils, is extremely hard to find. The study said that the fish's brain was exceptionally well preserved. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments. Stay connected for more exciting discussions and updates in our next podcast.